strikes every time she moves. And everybody. Yes, everybody is watching her, but she's looking at us, or she's right here, right now. Jamaican world renowned supermodel, TV personality, and motivational speaker, Stacey McKenzie, along with Narissa, Shamara, and Dariana from the Walk Camp, are here to discuss the influence and inspiration driving the Walk Camp. We will discuss the initiative's objective of instilling confidence in young girls, encouraging them to embrace and empower their authentic selves, and some other things. Hi, Stacey, how are you? Hi. I'm good, thank you. How are you doing? I'm doing fabulous. Good. Hi, ladies. How are you? Hi. Happy Hi. to have you here this morning with us. Thank you. So much. Stacey, the walk camp, mm -hmm. I'm sure it started from somewhere. Yes. So share a little bit about the, the story of the initiative. How did it all begin? So um, coming from a certain type of community when growing up in Jamaica, and then when I moved to foreign, moving to Canada, I lived in a certain type of community where we did not have access to you know, meeting certain types of people and learning certain types of careers, career goals, or even just getting mentorship. Yeah. So um, I decided that uh, once I got the opportunity to be a part of the fashion industry and you know the, the, the blessings that I got within that industry, um, I said to myself, it's really important for me to go back to where I came from and to give back to where I came from, especially mm -hmm. to the girls. Yeah. Because I know what it feels like to be a young girl and to you know, not have that mentorship or have that person to guide me. You know, other than my mother, I didn't really have anybody to you know, guide me along my journey, you know, to help make my journey a little bit easier. So I created the walk camp. Uh, uh, you know, I, I literally stayed home for about six months and I sat there and I just like designed this whole camp where they get to meet all these different types of people. And what I did was I looked at my roster of people that I've worked with and people that I met along my journey and continue to meet along my journey. And I just basically cold called them. Yeah. And I said, you know what, listen, only can I get at least like an hour or two hours of your time, right? And come and speak to the girls then, yeah. share your story and then teach them how to get into your industry, inspire them, yeah, you definitely. know, help them to like, you know, realize too that they are, you know, beautiful and amazing and, you know, smart and talented and they could do and be whatever it is that no, they want to do and be in life. I mean, Stacey, it seems you, you, you got a lot of inspiration from, of course, your very own experience, but the Walk Camp focuses on, you know, inspiring and empowering young mm -hmm. women, as you mentioned. Mm -hmm. What personal experience or insights led you to believe that such empowerment is crucial for this age group? What personal insights? Along my journey, um, um, I met a lot of models. Uh, well, first of all, my personal, yeah. So along my journey as a model, right, in the beginning, I did not have anyone to guide me like that in the business. It's a very cutthroat industry. It's all about self. So the people that I met along the way, they were more so like, no, uh -uh, mm -hmm. I'm not going to help you because then you're going to turn up bigger than me. You know what yeah. I saying? And then like, you know, and then not only that, um, being a black girl in the industry, especially a model, right, um, there's just only one, there was, at the time there was only one place for a black girl, right? Mm -hmm. When we're doing fashion shows and stuff like that, a designer will basically just book one black girl and one black guy, wow. and that's it, right? So mm -hmm. there was, it was very competitive, and people did not want to help each other out. So other models that I've met, you know, when we meet each other, they don't want to help each other out. Yeah. Even the established ones, they did not want to help. Okay. Right. They did not want to mentor me or mentor any other so girls. So changing how right? things yes. are done. Yeah. So yeah. I said, I'm like, no, nah, man, this ain't cool. So I did what I did for myself in terms of like, I taught myself how to walk. I taught myself how to pose, you know, for, for so I'm able to like, you know, do, you know, my craft better. I had to teach myself that. Yeah. Right. But when I asked for help to, you know, get that help to, to teach me, I wasn't getting that. Yeah. So I did it for myself and I said, you know what, if the most high God blesses me, to like, you know, make a name for myself within the industry, but now I keep it for self because I yeah. do strongly believe that we are given our blessings for reasons. And it's not just for us to keep for self, it's for us to also help others and like, you know, give others the opportunity to like, you know, help them along their yeah, journey. You're paying it forward, to make it, Yeah, you're to paying make it, it a little forward. bit easier. We love that. Now, yeah. in terms of the Walk Camp's mission to mm -hmm. inspire girls or young girls to love and own who they are with mm -hmm. confidence. And despite their circumstances Despite your life. circumstances. Could mm -hmm. you elaborate on like specific strategies or activities that the camp employs to, to achieve this goal? Okay, so uh, one of the biggest things that I, you know, um, deal with my, uh, do with my girls is I try to instill in them confidence. Building that strong sense of self, 
right? Bil building that, um, you know, um, that faith in themselves. Well, first of all, faith in the Most High God, but faith in themselves as well mm -hmm. to know that they are beautiful, they are smart, they are intelligent, they are, you know, able to do whatever it is that they want to do in life. They can achieve their goals and dreams in life yeah. as long as they have that strong sense of self and that strong confidence within themselves okay. because they have to love themselves first. So that is a big part of it for me with, with my girls because I had to do that for myself, yeah. right? Being taught, being teased and told that, you know, I'm gonna look good, I'm gonna look cute, I'm gonna look pretty, I'm gonna look like dundus, I'm a yellow man daughter and them kind yeah. of things that, you know, it really affected me growing up, right? Being different looking really affected me growing up by the way how people used to treat me. So it took a long time for me to like get to that place where I'm like, you know what? If them not like me, I feel them business. Yeah. As long as me love You're me, I'm gonna know me. I'm gonna know so the most Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna know the most I got have me, I'm good. You're good. Right? But it took me a long time. So I make sure that with my girls, I instill it, like I try to instill in them the importance of loving themselves, owning who they are, right? Believing in themselves, right? Having that strong sense of self mm -hmm. and that confidence to go out there and go and go after their dreams and so, goals in so life. So Stacey, you have a lot of motivational talks with the girls. Yes. I'm sure you have some training as well in terms of how to walk and how to pose. I mean, <laughs> That's you know? a part of it. Yeah. Well, a major, okay, so what I've done is, it's not just about modeling. This is not a modeling camp. Mm -hmm. It's an all around camp in terms of they get to meet all different types of mentors. So yes, I'm the okay. one who does you know the fashion side of it when it comes to modeling, because that's what I know, that's my okay. industry. Okay, right? well, and I, Sorry, I actually want to hear from the girls, though, <laughs> because I'm sure they've been having a grand time and learning a lot from the walk camp, ladies. Could you could you share your testimonial um, in terms of the impact the program has had on your life so far? Mm -hmm. So is it, this is who this is the Narissa. 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 Mm -hmm. All right, Narissa, tell me first up. So I've been in this camp for the past four years. It has definitely been an experience, an amazing experience. Um, Learning with different mentors is definitely fun, hearing their stories because you often see people on TV and say, oh, she's so pretty, oh, you know, she made it in life, but you don't know how she got there. So okay. hearing their story is definitely an important factor. And coming into this camp, I had no idea what I wanted to do. I didn't know what I wanted to be, but after a while... You figured it out. I've been inspired, positively inspired. Yeah. All right, Narissa, yeah. let me hear from Dariana. Who? Dariana. Yes, yes. Dariana. So, Tell me about, uh, you know, how has this pack, uh, this camp, sorry, impacted your life? Okay, so four years ago, I was in school doing work and all those stuff. And then I heard the news of my mom being passed away, being passed away. And then it, it kind of shook me a lot. And then Auntie Stacy. Oh came. no, we're getting all teary eyed up here. Oh no, <laughs> it's, it's fine, we're strong. She came to my graduation and said that she wanted me to be a part of her, mm -hmm. the walk camp. So being in mine, I didn't really know what to expect at being at that camp. I was very lonely and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. But joining, I have met a lot of nice people. And it has really changed your life. Me. Really, really changed your life, Narissa. No, that's, that's, nice. that's Dariana. I'm so sorry. Very grateful of what this camp has given me. Mm -hmm. And I have to say that I love them very much. Mm, Dariana, yes, you can. Yes, you can. Mm. It seems like the walk camp is changing lives, Stacey. One life at a time. One life at a time. And then oh, my final friend, Dariana, thank you so much for, for sharing that part of your spirit and part of your soul with us here on Weekend Smile this morning. And we can say that you are bound for greatness, Cheers. especially with the walk camp behind you. Guess what? The rest is history. Just keep going. And my final friend right here, I heard from um, Narissa, I heard from Doriana, so it's Shamara. Yes, it's yes. Shamara. Um, hi, as you said, my name is Shamara. Um, the wall camp. Um, as the other two, I've been here for four years and it has been an experience. I had a lot of fun. I met new people. The mentors are awesome. They're sweet and their stories are inspirational. They taught us, well, well, they taught us that we need to give back. We can start off small. Yes, we, all right, we are children. We don't have anything big but we do have our own talents and we can use that and 
give those give back to those who need and give back mm -hmm. to those who helped us so far along the way yeah and the mentors well they are from different um how can i put it careers different careers, careers and careers backgrounds yeah so each one of them give us their story and they give us um their opinions and and basically like you know give us how like they just <laughs> they help you a lot of inspiration yeah. they give you a lot of advice to write mm -hmm. i'm sure how to get it done well ladies all the very best we are proud of you you are Thank beautiful you. you are strong you are amazing and anything that you put your mind to you can achieve it so thank you so much for joining us thank you Stacey, so much if persons want to donate or get in touch with the walk camp how can we find you quickly before we um, go so uh the handle the, the handles for the walk camp is the walk camp jamaica and you can email us at the walk camp at gmail.com and the website for donations and all of that um the walkcamp.org usually with the donations um i would like to get the girls like sorted out for school okay right so anything that could help to get them go back to school and they don't have to worry about yeah you know the yeah. parents don't have to worry about nothing that's what i'm that's that's where it all goes to okay right all so right. yes thank you Stacey, so much thank you so much for joining yeah, us thank this you. morning ladies thank you so much thank you as so much well. for having us. your stories are so touching and as i said you're bound for greatness. So yes, just keep pushing. Are. Thank you so much. Thank Supermodel, you. TV personality, and motivational speaker, Stacey McKenzie, along with Narissa Shamara and Dariana from The Walk Camp. Oh my goodness, goosebumps. I'm sure you have goosebumps too. So donate, get in touch with them. Stay with us. We'll soon come back.